Hey, how's it going everyone? Bo here from BZ Up. Today I wanted to show you a big thing. A lot of people come to St. Croix and they ask themselves, how can I catch the muskie? And today I'm here to help you do so. So let's get into it. Here we are at St. Croix. If you want to see the exact day that I'm at, I'm not sure if it really matters, but here we go. We're on this little hump. Obviously, these are two hills here, two mountains, um, and then we have a cloudy day. And first thing I have to say, there is a little bit of a paywall, and it's not something you have to pay actual money for, but I will say the only way you're able to do this specific way of catching muskie is if you have a boat with a trolling motor. So make sure you have a boat with a trolling motor. I realize if you don't have one or if there's a long way before you do get one then you're probably gonna leave and you know if so feel free but might as well keep watching so that you can see how to do this once you do get a boat with a trolling motor let's go ahead and just turn on the engine here and go on over to our special pike and musky alley of st. Croix <laughs> All right, we're getting towards the end here, as you can see. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna slow it down here, and I'm going to come right over to this corner right here, and then I'm gonna pull a U-turn. Pull a U-turn, Hino. 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 I'm telling you, he's so used to using a spaceship. Sometimes, sometimes, forgets how to drive a boat. All right, we did our U-turn, and now what I'm gonna do, get up into the trolling motor section now and all I'm gonna do here I've got my jerk bait we're using a one and a half ounce uh, six aught jerk bait tiger stripes I think is that what it's called uh, a lemon with black lem a lemon with black stripes there you go we're using a fruit we're also using the Basscaster 7 foot 10 and the counselor 3500p feel free to use whatever rod and reel you want to use that you think will work for musky but I just did a video on this being one of my favorite rods in the game and if you haven't seen that make sure you go check it out but go ahead and uh, get your favorite rod with this jerk bait make sure you have that titanium leader on there because these guys can bite through the line and all we're gonna do is toss it right back into this back corner here and if you've never considered this before there is trolling in the game with trolling motors you can only use one rod and this may look confusing at this point you're thinking okay we're throwing a jerkbait out there it's basically hitting the bottom it's not doing anything uh, yes it's very true um, and all I'm gonna do is kind of do a little pumping action like this I, I'm not sure if it really makes that much of a difference but uh, I keep getting bikes as I pump it and it like kind of goes up in the air. So that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna keep going forward, get a little pump to rise it off the bottom. Once you get over to this side, you can either do one of two things. You can continue going, do a little U-turn and continue going back the other direction or you can reel in and do the same process but going the opposite way. But all we're looking for is a moment like that where you have a fish on and at this point you're thinking okay we either have uh, a muskie or we have a pike because <laughs> the muskie and the pike both like these jerk baits this guy looks like a uh, pike if I had to guess come here you come here you yep we got a pike here which isn't that bad because the pike pay better than muskie anyway but let's go ahead and we'll try it again gonna toss it right back in here again and now we're gonna go the opposite way there we go, fish on. Got a little bit of fight in him, doesn't he? There we go. Is this a clear? No, just a regular muskie. 17 pounds on this guy. But I mean, there you go. I mean, it's as simple as that. It's as simple as just tossing it out and just driving your boat and like I said you don't need to have that stop and go to top you know the pop up or the slow retrieve or the straight retrieve whatever it may be you don't need any of that stuff you just need to toss it out drive your boat and wait for a bite I like to give it a couple pumps I think that the fish it kind of activates the fish to go for it but you know find your find your groove find your groove find out your best way of doing it good little musky here let's keep him in the Try it again, try it again here. Our, our good time is running out here. I've been fishing a little bit. 
just give us a few more a few more tries here oh there we go fish on fish on fish on fish on they have a british accent let's go let's go get him in here get him in here another northern pike 10 pounds there we go there we go i got one right over there I was just about to say, you might have to try a different lure. I'm not really sure why they're not going for it anymore. Change it up, but this is a pike. Looks like, yep, looks like a pike. Ooh, got some attention right at the start. Right at the start, the lure change might have been just what we needed. He is putting up a bit of a fight, pulling us into the reeds. This looks like another pike, actually. It is, yeah, another pike. There we go, hooked up. Doesn't look very big though, does it? Hey, another tiger muskie. Top notch. Well, I'll tell you what, everyone. Uh, you know, I hope you catch some bigger ones than I did today. But uh, the, the, the strategy is sound right there. You know, you can see yourself doing this, trolling along with the jerkbait here at St. Croix, catching these guys. You can catch the, the pike, you can catch the muskie, and there's what? Three different types of muskie, clear muskie, muskie, and tiger muskie to catch here at St. Croix. And you can catch, I'm pretty sure you can catch a unique of all of them. So yeah, go for it. Go out here, do some trolling of yourself. You know, get out of this little uh, hidey hole and get out into, uh, you know, along along the uh, the shoreline of all of this, honestly. You've got lots of lots of water to cover anyway, so hopefully you catch some big ones. If this video is helpful in any way, make sure you hit that like button. Really appreciate it. And subscribe for more helpful videos in the future. Hit that bell so that you get notifications. And if you want to check us out every Monday, Wednesday night for our 7.30 to 9.30 p.m. Central live streams playing hunting and fishing games, really appreciate it. Hope to see you there. But until next time, everyone, take care. And as always, remember... We're one planet, one family, game on.